Morning guys. Nothing to report last night, but just look at this view this morning. Just gone six o'clock. Mist is rolling in over the lake. A little bit colder last night. And that's why the mist is coming up off the off the lake. But just look at that, look. What a beautiful, beautiful sight. And they wonder why we go fishing, eh? No bites for me last night. Just been woken up by the old black chickens picking up me elk baits. I've seen a couple of fish show about 20 yards past where milk baits are, so you never know, we might get, we've still got a chance of a bite this morning. You never know what might happen. So uh, let's get that kettle on, have a brew this morning, and uh, just enjoy the mist rolling in, and hopefully, you never know, we might get a bite. Just enjoy this. Welcome back. It's um, <clears throat> what's the time? It's about it's about ten to six in the morning, and uh, you're back with me. And it's just the sun's about to come up. I'll just show you. Just have a look out there. Beautiful sunrise. No mist this morning, but looks absolutely beautiful out there. And we had a bit of carnage last night. I was about, it was, I was just about, uh, well, I was just lying down, looking at my iPad, looking at a few bits on Facebook and that last night. And about half ten, quarter to eleven, I had an absolute one toner on the middle rod. Absolute flyer. And um, picked up the middle rod. And just tanking and just went straight into a wee bed and was playing this fish for ages. It was just solid. They managed to coax her out by just keeping pressure on. And went to another wee bed, done the same, get the pressure on. And finally, <coughs> finally, um, finally uh, managed to. Managed to Net are absolutely stunning, sort of half linear peach of a fish at 37.2. So I'm just going to show you the, uh, the imagery from that last night. So that was a, that, that was a proper battle. That was, but it just shows. I, I took the photo straight away. Didn't sack it. You're not allowed to sack it on here. I haven't sacked a fish for years on any water. Because with today's technology, with LED lights and and uh, the cameras we've got now, with flashes and all that and things like that, you just you, you just don't need to take take the uh, you just don't need to um, retain fish. You just don't you know. I just leave it in the net, cut the line, leave it in the net, go and get myself sorted out with a camera or cameras or whatever, and then just just. Take the sh take the shots, and they come out like day shots. You know, there's no need in this day and age to net a fish anymore. You know, to retain a fish, sack a fish, or keep in a retainer. You know, it, it, you can keep it in a, in a retainer, way it itself for sorted, but there's no need to to keep a fish in a sack for anymore. So, um, you know, that that was absolutely made up with that after you know getting picked up by the black chickens yesterday morning. All that type of thing. It was um, you got to have the confidence. You got to, you got you got to um, believe that you're going to get a bite. You know, it's karma, isn't it? You know, that's what I believe. I believe in karma. Feeling confident. You know, I rechucked them a little bit further out than what I what I was doing. And I'd, after I rechucked them, put a little bit of bait out there, just on dark. Just so the old seagulls and swans and the old black chickens couldn't get them. And they was rewarded for my efforts. Uh, about quarter to eleven, the world made up with that epic battle. Like all the battles in there are epic battles. 
and a Kraken 37-2 linear mirror. So yeah, have another look at have another look out there this morning. Absolutely beautiful out there. Absolutely gorgeous, you know. Black chickens are out in force already. And that weed's starting to die back. It won't be long before that weed's non-existent, I think. Another month and it'd be gone. So that's me, I'm gonna wake up a bit now, get coffee on, get sorted and um Two or three hours time, I've got to pack up and go to work, so result in having one. But it's still time for the other rods. I didn't cast out, I didn't recast the rod out. I just wanted to leave it out, I didn't want to let a bat out there too mad. And uh, you never know, I might even have another bite, you never know. Right, see you soon. I've just got the uh, the rods, just about to reel them in, just about off to work. Got all the rest of my gear, more or less packed away. I've got my brolly over there, drying out, so it did, don't go away wet. I've got the rest of my kit there. Ready to go and get the van and um, go off to work this morning. Sorry if this blog's been a bit long, but it's like my first one I've done raid, just so we had a little bit of catch up and all that type of thing. But if you like it, put a thumbs up, like it in the in the um, in the YouTube, subscribe to my channel. And uh, I'll see you uh, next time for the next vlog.